girl Shoshana and today I'm back with another cooking video. I'm sorry my face is not in the camera today. I'm just not feeling my best and y'all I'm tired as hell but I wanted to um, record this video for you guys. Today we're going to be making beef and broccoli and I'm excited as hell. Um, right here I got a chuck roast boneless steak. I'm going to clean it but I want to cut it first so I can show you guys how I'm, how I'm cutting it. So I'm just going to cut this. So you guys, this is all my meat cut up. I'm about to just clean this now. Okay, make sure you clean your meat. I want to show you how it looked before I had um before I cleaned it. So I wanted to like cut it to show you how I'm cutting it. So it's clean. I always clean it with lemon juice. And I'm gonna let this soak for like a couple of minutes, you guys. And I will see y'all once I have it clean. So it's all seasoned. I didn't want to put a lot of seasoning in here because we're gonna have seasoning from the browning of the, the, the gravy sauce for it. So I'm just gonna let this sit for a little bit and I'm about to show y'all how I'm going to cut up my broccoli. So I have one onion chopped. I'm just move this out my way. guys now that I have all my preparations ready let's get ready to cook so in this bowl I'm going to put two tablespoons two tablespoons of cornstarch you can find this in your bacon aisle y'all so I'm going to put two tablespoons one two that in there and then I'm going to add I'm gonna add a half a teaspoon of garlic powder in here and then I'm going to add two tablespoons of water And then we're gonna just give this a mix. Like that. I'm gonna take my beef and I'm gonna pour this on here, y'all. Just mix that around. And then that's it for the beef. So we're gonna cook our beef now. I'm gonna put one tablespoon of vegetable oil and then we're gonna wait for that to get hot. So now we're gonna add our beef. We're gonna add our beef and just let our beef cook until it's ready. Guys, my meat is done. I let it cook for 11 minutes. I'm gonna take this out 
and just put it in my bowl and place it to the side and then we're going to make the broccoli and then when my broccoli is done then we're going to just add it back to the pan and put everything together another tablespoon so one more tablespoon add your onions and then add your broccoli and we're gonna let this cook for about four to five minutes I'm gonna let this cook and I still got everything on medium high so for four to five minutes we're gonna let this cook for while this is cooking I'm going to show you guys how to make the rest of the sauce for the steak so you're going to put one tablespoon of cornstarch One tablespoon of cornstarch. One teaspoon of great grated ginger. Two tablespoons of brown sugar. And one third cup of less sodium soy sauce. And then a half a cup of water. And I'm just gonna mix that around. Out. Oh, it's been five minutes. I let this broccoli cook. I'm going to just add my meat back in. Get all that in there. Mix this all together. And now I'm going to add the sauce that I just made. Still needs to be mixed a little bit. So I'm going to put this. And I'm gonna just let this cook for two minutes. Okay, you guys, it's been two minutes and this is done. Look at that. Just gonna add like a little splash of sesame oil you don't have to but I'm just doing it like that and I'm just mix that around oh my gosh I'm so excited I love beef and broccoli you guys and I can just smell that sesame oil now that I just put like a little bit in there next so you guys look at that just put it on a plate i'm just add some sesame seeds make it look pretty and that is it i already tasted it off camera 
and it tastes so so good I hope that you guys try this don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys next time bye